Hi Taurus and uh, welcome to this bonus reading. I'm doing a few all for soul connections and separation. So this is about you and your person, soulmate or twin flame, whatever label you want to put on it. Your sign came out in the general collective reading. So that's why I'm doing this reading for you all. You may want to check that reading out if you haven't seen it already. So we'll just now sort of dive a bit deeper. We might get the same things come through, but we might get some extra messages, as I said. So let's just see the energy around your connection. Okay, so we've got heart chakra in reverse. So heart chakra block for some of you. Things you need to heal, things from the past you're holding on to, maybe connected to your person as well. And we've got temple path in reverse. Some of you are not following your divine path. Um, your soul calling, I'm getting with that, following your heart. I'm getting karmic situations though, again, coming through. So, you know, it could be both of you could be your person, potentially. So we're going to look at um, your person's energy, first of all. So we've got Leo coming out. I feel, um, some of you might not be aware of this, but I feel your person is checking you out, seeing what you're up to. Because I'm getting a positive energy from this person in terms of you. We've got Divine Masculine energy coming out, so it could be your DM here. I feel they've had some sort of clarity with the Ace of Swords in terms of how they feel. You might not have seen this person for a long time, but you are on their mind and in their heart at the moment. Um, I feel some of you might have pulled away, sort of tried to detach, and that's where this shift has happened, especially if you're twin flames, because with the magnets, Obviously, you can be repelled from each other and drawn to one another. It's about finding that balance. So if you've pulled away, they're sort of coming towards you with their energy, potentially. There could be an age gap here. I feel they've, yeah, they've also made a change here in their surroundings. I'm getting a very bold energy here. Um, someone who's standing their ground, speaking up. Very confident energy. Wow. We've got the Divine Feminine energy. Now this is your energy as well, Taurus. It's come out. So you are definitely on their mind. That is a given. Um, also, this is their own inner divine feminine energy here. So they're possibly caring for themselves more at the moment. We've, yeah, because we've got DM, DF energies here. Come out, so they're aligning. They could have some financial issues at the moment, but they're trying to be positive. I just keep feeling they miss you. That's like really what's coming through here. Um, and yeah, I'm feeling the block heart chakra now. In their energy. So there's a void there. In this person, emotions, 
Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling quite burdened. Um, heavy energy as well. So it's like a mixture here coming out in their energy. Something they potentially need to end. Um, sorry if you can hear that noise, it's just my cat playing at the window. Um, this is, I feel, for some of them, where they're standing their ground and making a change in their life. Okay, so that could be why your sign came out for this reading. So let's see your energy. Two of Cups. Yep, so you're trying to manifest, I feel, your person. Wow. Okay, cards all went everywhere there. So some of you could be a bit worried, a bit doubtful as well. Which is also why your sign might have come through. Okay, so Leo again and Virgo have come out as star signs. You could have that in your chart, could be your person sign. Some of you, yeah, you're really trying to go within at the moment and be strong. Because I feel for some of you, you don't really see anything. You're not in communication, I feel, for a lot of you. And Spirit is guiding you, guiding you to go within. Trust how you feel. Don't try not to listen too much to other people around you who might be trying to sway you. You don't understand what this is. My cat's so playful this morning. Um, just the way it is this morning, but um, she's having fun. Wow, okay, so we've got the emperor and empress over here. So definitely divine unions here, twin flames for some of you. And I just feel this alignment here for you both um, within your energies. Some of you have really been healing you're healing at the moment, trying to make changes potentially as well. We've got Aries that's come through as well. Um, some of you want to make a change here. You want to take action in your life with these two. And you've been thinking about this for a while. Go with how you feel, obviously. Um, yeah, I'm just getting this other energy here that might have been in the picture, third party, but I, I just feel that's clearing. Um, your person's been very stuck in a situation, potentially, but with the 10, that could be coming to an end. Okay. Anything else just on your, both of your energy here that we need to know? Wow. Yeah, there's some healing here in terms of things from the past. May be connected to you both or your childhood, your past, um, third party. It's coming out again, it could be the block between you both. But I do feel a lot of memories and nostalgia, which I really felt for your person. Okay, so let's take a healing message for you. Anything you might need to hear, Taurus? So we got green for the heart chakra that came out, obviously. It says compassion. So have compassion with yourself and your person. The three of swords, that does link with the healing. Maybe things from the past that you regret or your person might regret. Um, wow, okay, so 
Everything happens for a reason. I picked up the deck and these two have stayed. So these are for you. We've got forward movement. This is your guidance. Keep going. This is like the chariot and the butterflies for change. Here, take action. So we had the emperor. And progress. Wow, I just feel there's progress here in your connection. Things are happening behind the scenes. And we've got green again for the heart chakra. So as you heal, as you both heal and align, which is coming out, the Emperor Empress, um, your connection then shifts. And there's forward movement here happening as well in your connection. Wow, okay, this is, yeah, that's why your sign came through, I feel. Let's just take um, an oracle card as well to finish. Beautiful reading. Claim it if it's yours. I would say it's quite positive. Wow. <laughs> okay, that one flew out. So we've got new experiences and possibilities. Yeah, definitely for you and potentially for this connection. She's wearing green, the colour of the heart chakra. So when you have both healed your heart chakras, which has come out, ha you know, found compassion for yourself and each other, you've got this new um, possibility ahead of you, potentially the butterfly there for change again. Abundance as well coming through. Wow, Taurus. Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed this little reading that I've done for you. Um, leave a comment if it resonates in any way. Thank you so much for being here. Sending lots of love to you all.